song ever. What boo boo? What boo boo? It's by the curtain. You see it? Okay, mommy will help you in a second, okay? I'm just getting these eggs going. Taking over our baby. living room. Baby toys in the living room? Yeah, they're taking over, Evie. The flowers and the toy. Mm -hmm. oh, I wanted to show you guys my table. Here, wait, let me turn this monitor off. TJ's taking a nap with Truett, and that is unneeded and very loud. <laughs> um, we're still doing our chairs, that's why we don't, they're not finished. But what do you guys think? I did this. By myself Let's show you guys some details I kind of did this to stress antique -ish kind of look but I think it just looks so much fresh and bright in here and it just goes with my decor so much better I had to sand it down and then I painted it this cream color it's like an off-white and then I went through and I used black paint and then I painted yeah. over the black paint oh, yeah. and then I sanded oh, it yeah. down a little bit and oh, I really yeah. like the effect that it gave if this would like focus and then I just used this matte top finish because I didn't want anything shiny yeah. and I think it looks so cute but I'm loving how the dining room is looking it's so cute so cute what do you think Ev do you like it yeah thanks girl <laughs> But today is Sunday. It's Super Bowl Sunday. We just got back from church and we had a failed attempt trying to get that one down. She fell asleep in the car for like 10 minutes and apparently that's like an hour nap. So we tried for like an hour to get her to go to sleep and we just gave up. But we have two Super Bowl parties that we're going to tonight. So she really needed a nap. <sighs> The struggle but i just wanted to thank everyone so much for all of your kindness and your prayers from my last video you guys are seriously so amazing tj actually starts his job tomorrow but we're really ready just to figure out our routine and just feel more settled you know it's just been really weird having him having him home even though i've loved having him home but it's just it's just felt weird and i'm ready just to have a routine you know you guys can understand but today's sponsor is Fimo meter but they send over their postnatal multivitamins this is a herb formulation for breastfeeding optimal nutrition for postpartum healing antioxidants and zinc to support immunity and turmeric extract to help with inflammation like this is what I need I wish I have been taking this my entire like postpartum journey I'm really sad they didn't reach out earlier, but I'm so happy that they did. This is vegetarian, gluten-free, um, it's third-party tested, and it says made with love and also made in the USA. Um, but seriously, like there are so many good vitamins on this thing, you can see here, which I love this because there's no like BS to it, it's just like the good stuff. So if that's the type of person you are, you're kind of, um, just want something you know that is giving you exactly what you need during this postpartum time, this is it. Your body's going through so much and so you need to make sure that you are taking care of yourself, especially when you're breastfeeding too because that baby is taking away all that nutrients just like when they were inside of you. How they were taking away nutrients, they're doing the same when they're breastfeeding. So you have to make sure that you are taking your multivitamins so that you feel 
good and you feel like a human you know they are a company that focuses solely on women they have so many other awesome vitamins as well so they have like ovulation and pregnancy stuff they have a basal thermometer health supplement definitely check them out and thank you so much female meter for sponsoring today's video which brings me to the reason why you have probably clicked on this video <sighs> and that is because I am planning on taking a pregnancy test today. I think I'm just like kind of stalling at this point just because I don't know what to think about it. I am eight months postpartum and I started my period when with Everly at seven months postpartum and I still have not started. Last month, I really felt like it was coming any day. I had all the symptoms for a period and then it just like never came. It was just like really weird. And then this month has been the same, um, but I've just noticed I've been so emotional. My hormones I can feel are just a bit all over the place right now. I am very happy at times and then I'll just get very down. It could just still be my body, just kind of, you know, getting back in order. Um, but then also I've just been having a few other symptoms, um, just very bloated, which definitely could just be a normal period symptom, but it also could mean something else. We'll just see what this test says together. And no matter what, I know that God's in control. If we had to choose or if we got to choose, we would wait to have our third until Truett is around two. But you never know. Welcome to my bathroom. Got the pregnancy test. I'm using the same ones that I used when we were trying for Truett because I still have quite a bit. A pee in a cup. That's what you do. Okay. I'm like a little bit nervous, but okay, I'm gonna dip it. One, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna just do like two because these tests are acting a little funky. Now for the long five minute wait, I'm gonna go ahead and start my timer. Oh my gosh, what if it's positive? Because I'm really not expecting it to be. I think I'm just hormonal. And um, I actually remember doing this um, after I had Everly. But I think it was around five months postpartum that I thought I could be pregnant. So maybe that's how it is for me. Maybe it, I will be starting in like two months. Because I started having symptoms around five months postpartum. Why am I so much later now? than I was my first pregnancy. I don't know, like I feel like he's nursing the same amount. Cause I know nursing can be a big part of it. Uh, my grandma actually told me she never started until after she was totally done nursing. So maybe that's how it's gonna be this round. I don't know, so. I mean, it's not a terrible issue to have, I guess. <laughs> I'm curious with any of you mothers that have had, that have multiple kids, like what, like, what was it like for you? Did you notice that things, like your period came faster or was it slower or was it always around the same time? I'm just curious. What if it's positive? <laughs> I keep thinking that, I'm like, keep thinking like, no, it's not, it's not positive. But then I'm like, what if it is positive? <gasps> God would really want this baby here if it was positive because we've been really careful. Oh, oh. My heart. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, I'm gonna look. I have two. I took two. <laughs> I think it's negative. Right? That looks pretty negative. I don't know why for a second it looked like... Yeah. Yeah. Just let you guys see for yourself. Is it focusing? That looks pretty negative, right? Um... Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm gonna make TJ look at it. TJ! What? Come look at my pregnancy test. No. <laughs> Come look at it. No. Why? I don't like you. Why? You do love me, it's why I'm pregnant. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Sometimes I feel like I just like see things with pregnancy tests. Do you guys do that? Like take a pregnancy test and then you have to like stare at it forever to like really soak it in. But this is negative. It's, it's the negative. Well, it doesn't look like I'm pregnant. Evie, what if mommy had another baby? Huh? huh? Yeah. He's right there, She's been exactly. very, yeah. She's right there. Is that what he's doing? Yeah, she's like, he's right there. <laughs> yeah, he's our baby. He's our baby. Yeah. Oh, you want mama. Huh? My. Oh, he's when it works, it's the like, It's not working. Yeah, I tried it. Okay. Try it. Try it. It's just working. Oh, they're working. Not pregnant, which is a good thing. <laughs> Mommy, no work. Well, we would be very happy with another baby. We would love that baby, Mommy, but no working, Mom. life would be very hard. It's not working again. Yeah. I don't know why it does that. I mean, I think it's because all your hair is all trapped in it. This is my baby right here right now. But yeah, so. I just don't know why I haven't started my period. Is that weird? Just no. weird. She's just like, I don't know. Let me just check my schedule and see if mine was. I, know, I don't know why I haven't started. I'm seriously so annoyed. I just filmed like multiple different clips. Um, and I went back and listened and my audio just like stopped working. I don't know what happened. I don't know if my mic wasn't all the way plugged in, which doesn't make sense because like some was working and some wasn't. So, oh, that's so frustrating. And now my... <laughs> Camera's about to die. But I guess I'll give you guys a little rundown of what happened. I unboxed a new product from Mapiful. I am doing a collab with them on Instagram. So I unboxed that and here it is, super cute. And then I hung it, super cute. And then Truett started pulling up on things, super cute. And then I took the old Mapiful sign and I put it up in our room. The rest of the day, I just need to clean and then we're gonna head off to our Super Bowl party. But I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys for watching. 